Hello, this is Mark with HowToOutlook.com. Today I am going to show you how to create and edit rules in Outlook 2010. Start by going to the Home tab in Outlook. Then go to the right side where it says Rules. Then click on Manage Rules and Alerts. Now click on New Rule on the left. Here is the main page for new rules. These are mostly pre-made rules that come with Outlook. You can look through these if you want to make a simple rule. We will make a new blank rule. If you start from a blank rule, you have to choose between either messages you receive or messages you send. For this tutorial, I'm going to make a rule for messages received. After pressing next, you will have conditions to choose from. You can look through the list for specific conditions. I'm going to use the one that says that it has to be with specific words in the subject. If you selected a condition that contains blue highlighted words, then you will need to specify further. To do this, go to the bottom where it says Step 2 and click on the blue letters. Each condition is different. For mine, it is asking me to specify which words in the subject will trigger the rule. I'm going to type in three common words used in spam messages. Press OK once you are done. Now press Next. It is now asking you what you want to do with the flagged messages. Since I am making an anti-spam rule, I will tell to go to a specific folder. There are many choices in here. You can look through them and find the one that best matches what you are trying to do. Since I clicked an option with blue letters, I need to specify further again. Once finished with this, you can add an exception. For example, I can add my friend's email and he will not be flagged for this rule even if he uses these words in the subject. Once you finish adding an exception, press next. Now is when you finalize your rule. You name it and then you can either apply the rule to current messages or only future ones. And then you have the choice of either turning the rule on or off. Once the settings are as desired, press finish. Then click apply and then OK. Now I will show you how to edit rules you already created. Once again, go to Rules, then Manage Rules. Highlight the rule you want to change, click on Change Rules, then Edit Rules Settings. Now you are in the edit page. You can change any part of the rule. I'm going to change it so it doesn't delete it. Then once you're finished, go through the setup again. To test the rule to show you how it works, I'm going to be sending myself an email with the specific words in it. I'm going to try to make this look like a real spam email. Here's the email in the spam folder. I did not move it here, it went here automatically. Thanks for watching and don't forget to rate, comment and subscribe.